guys, today I'm going to show you this very soft everyday makeup look. I'll start out by highlighting my brow bone with Strange. Next, I'll go in with Limit as the base of my color on the crease of my lid and blend that out real smooth. With a flat shadow brush, I'll pat on half baked to my lid, making sure to evenly distribute the color. This is actually one of my favorite colors, so I like to pat on a lot. In the outer corner of my eye, I'll begin to put on the color Buzz, bringing it up to the crease of my eye as well. And with a fluffy brush, I'll blend, blend, blend this out. Taking a smudge brush, I'll go under my bottom lash line with Trick. We'll of course do the same things that we did on this side to your other eye. Now for eyeliner, I really like to take my time if I can. I'll begin by creating the wing and then by creating a rough outline of what my liner will look like. I then go ahead and fill it in. I'm very picky when it comes to my eyeliner. I really dislike seeing ridges or crease marks, so I smooth it out as best as I can get it. When it comes to eyeliner, I think everybody has those days where you end up like a panda for messing up so bad. <laughs> but don't worry, um, take it slow, and if you do mess up, just take a Q-tip and fix your mistake. You'll want to go ahead and repeat it all on the other side as well. Fun fact, I have uneven eyelids, so it's even harder for me to make both eyes look the same. But I try. Just remember, practice makes perfect. Using my favorite mascara, I'll go ahead and apply one coat to each eye. I only do the bottom lash line because I feel that if I apply it on my top lashes as well, it glams up the look too much. So I find this kind of funny. The mascara one that I'm using doesn't actually come with the mascara bottle. I don't know the brand or where it came from or how I acquired it, but I love using it. And yeah, it's kind of weird, but oh well, it is what it is. So what I've been doing is taking that same smudge brush we used before and because I usually get mascara on my skin, I like to smudge it out a little bit. So to add a little bit of color to my face, I'll take now my blush brush and dab it into a soft rose color and then apply it to my cheekbones. For my lips, I used Pink Star and dabbed it on the color very lightly. It is a very sheer color but has sparkles which I love. Lastly, to finish off this look, I'll apply highlighter with a fan brush lightly to add a bit of dimension to my face. I'll put it on the tip of my cheeks, my nose bridge, and Cupid's bow. Try not to add too much. Remember, we're trying to go for a soft look. This is the final result. I usually wear it on a daily basis. It takes me about 15 minutes to do, and it works great for me when I want to look nice, but I don't have too much time to do my makeup. If you like this tutorial, give it a thumbs up, comment any suggestions, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching!